I get so caught up in the middle Thinking of drowning in those blue eyes I'm losing sight cause I am falling I'm so deep down, deep down And it's not a lie That I die I can't hide What's up, you guys? Vinyl Vixen and Slim Shetty. What's up, guys? Here at Rap Sesh. Um, this week, we are going to showcase a really fun project. Right now, we're working on a Dodge Hellcat Red Eye. Yeah. Yama. Super cool car. Uh, for Clark, shout out to Clark. We just did his charger and that whole carbon fiber setup. Um, a few weeks ago. Yeah. So now we're doing his new Hellcat. Do a little bit of clear bra, a nice some two tone. tone. Yeah, it is nice. These things, activities. Um, but today we're actually going to be showcasing a project we did a few months ago. Um, it is the Function Factory slash Ceramic Pro USA was Ford it, Mustang. Was it that long ago? I don't even know. I don't know. <laughs> it was a while ago. A couple weeks, maybe. No, we were at RapsCon a couple oh, weeks okay. ago. Okay. So it was a couple months ago. Um, this was a really cool project. Um, we've actually wrapped his car. This would be our second time now that we've done a wrap for him. Um, but he has a Ford Mustang that's all like souped out and it's getting ready to go on this vlog series um, to a bunch of different US like tracks. And he's gonna do this whole vlog thing on it. Uh, mm -hmm. His name is Charles. He runs the Function Factory Performance. And um, really, really cool dude. Like I said, we did a wrap for him a few years ago for SEMA and he always likes to go crazy, multi-layer. Yeah, the one we wore was like three layers of chrome that we had to wrap. So I did like the, you know how Mustang hips are? They're, They're like table crazy tops. table tops pretty much. Like a chair. And I had to wrap that three times with three with different chrome layers of that chrome. Was cut, so you had to make it look perfectly <laughs> cut. Like It was, it was challenging, too. challenging for uh -huh. sure. But anyways, they reached out to us again. So they're doing this vlog series on their car. They wanted to wrap it. And then what they actually did with uh, higher quality detail in Ceramic Pro USA, they coated only half of the car, like straight down the middle. And I think it's the driver's side that's coated. Yeah. Um, because this is a four layer wrap and it's going to all these tracks and it's gonna get super beat up, it's gonna be really cool seeing over the next year how much better the Ceramic Pro protects the vinyl versus it being on its own. Yeah, I'm pretty excited about that. Right, and especially because it's a four layer wrap and their the base color is like a white metallic with a pink It's sheen. a satin white, so it gets dirty really easy. Yeah, like so, even when he brought it by. Um, he brought it by like a week later. And it had like It was completely covered in dirt on one dirt. side and the other side was perfectly clean. Yeah, like you can actually <laughs> see a, a difference a of where the line. Ceramic Pro is. So I'm really excited to see how that holds up. It's going to be a really good sell point to prove to people the well, difference that it's going to make on your wrap. Yeah, because you don't see it ever. Like you don't know that it's on the car unless, unless you're actually you feeling the car. the car. But yeah. then at what, once you're actually seeing that line straight down the middle of the car, you're like, holy crap, it does actually make a difference. Yeah. That's, it's crazy. So if you guys want to keep up with it, um, check it out on Function Factory Performance's page. I think they have a YouTube channel as well as uh, Ceramic Pro USA has been posting about it. They did a really cool video that was part one of the vlog series that goes over the whole wrap process with us here in the shop. Yeah. So make sure you guys check that out. Anyways, with this car, he didn't want to do a single layer print. That's just, that's boring. It's been done before. And I mean, why would he come to us if he just wanted a single print? We, yeah. We do, we just... do, we like to go crazy. So what we're doing actually is we talk them into doing a four layer wrap um, that we are basically creating all by hand. Um, mm, there just... was a rendering created by... Heroes. Heroes. Uh, <laughs> So the rendering was Wait. created by Heroes. Here's like a little peek at one of them. Um, and then we kind of set up how we wanted to wrap it. So the base of this car is gonna be in this KPMF matte white pink starlight. Really cool, kind of has a pink sheen to it. And then the pink that he picked is Hexus. Super pink. Yeah, gloss Indian, Indian pink. Super girly, but it's like the perfect ceramic pro pink. Indian. That's what we were going for. Brilliant. Yes, and then we have this Oracle 970RA gloss telegray. Telegray. Avery SW900 textured carbon fiber. So we have four different brands, and we are creating this entire design by hand. 
Um, with knifeless. With knifeless, yeah. And the way that we do this, like, I priced this out like weeks before I, I even saw the car. And the way that I was able to price this out was like down to the square inch. If you guys have seen our YouTube videos before, we did one episode where I talked about how we template color changes and things like that. And that really, really comes in handy because I essentially did all of this work and figured out the estimate when I was sitting in the car, like on the way to New, New Mexico. Yeah. It took me like yeah, two or did. three hours of mathing. And I was able to base all of my sizing off of a previous Mustang that we did a color change on. So I had one of my old um, papers like this that's got all my measurements for the car. And then I basically sized everything out on what I thought it would be. Um, based on the scaling of the image and the measurements I had. So this is all of the measurements for the car. This is like an insane amount. Oh. Um, this includes all the decals and everything. Michael's probably glazing over right now because he does not math. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't do, I'm not good at math. So I lose you. I I'm good with my hands. So, I work good But with I just want to show this because this is really cool. If you guys are trying to create estimates on the spot for like some crazy big trailer or an RV wrap or like something like this that's custom, it's not just a single layer print, it's multiple layers of material. I know down to the square inch what it's going to cost me on film and how I need to price this before I've seen the car or verified any measurements. And so you'll see like these are all my little cut diagrams just for the decals and everything. And it's we like have, Tetris. Yeah, we have more than enough material and I know exactly what I need, exactly what I need to order. Um, if you are curious though, normally a color change on a Mustang would only be like 22 yards. Um, yeah. This project right here with all the layers is 57 yards. So just to put into perspective, That's how with many all the layers decals and all we're the creating. Multi-layer yeah. decals and all that stuff. Yep. But, and so some people may question and be like, well, why don't you just plot those stripes and lay them on already, you know, layered, which is a, probably an easier way to do it. But we're not designers, and so we always do things by hand. So we just choose to do it that way. We like to do it by hand. And, and it's that way, easier to trust yourself than trust somebody that's not there with the car yes, measuring things. It's I would a lot harder that way happen. for us. And well, and the the it's a lot easier to create a line, especially going like something over the hood like this. It's really hard to lay that down with an already to lay a plotted, plotted line. design yeah. over a curved surface is really hard. So, so yeah, we definitely like to make this stuff by hand. Yeah. And like, if you guys remember our SEMA Mustang from 2018, we did a, a three-layer, multi-layer design, and it was the same thing. Like our our guy, our customer had a design concept, and he wasn't sure the print was going to line up, and they were having issues designing it. So I was like, okay, give me a photo, and we created the whole design by hand. So that's what we really specialize in and like doing. We good at copying it. things. Yeah, you can create pretty much anything by hand. Now, getting on a computer is a totally different story. Like a human copier. Yeah. On um, So yeah, we ran all the decals today. We plotted them, we did a mask them. They're all ready to go. And then we're about ready to get started on the actual color change process, so. Yeah. Yeah, yeah.
watching this week. Uh, make sure to check out the Ceramic Pro and Function Factory performance video on their YouTube channels. Shout out to Charles. Thank you so much for working with us. Thanks, Charles. Um, yeah, if you guys want to keep up with our daily fun, make sure to follow our Facebook and Instagram. That's Final Vixen Raps and Rap Sesh AZ. We also have our Twitch platform, which is under Rap Sesh. Um, you can find that at twitch.tv slash rap sesh. We do live um, tutorials, like live stream rap sessions. So if you guys are wanting training from us, you want to come shadow or whatever, like we just can't do that right now. But this is a really cool way to connect with us live time and watch us rap. Um, today we're actually going to be doing a, a tank, a motorcycle, motorcycle tank, tank in Cheetah Rap Gloss. So this is like a really, really good time that you can see it happen as it goes. Um, and you can interact with us. If you have questions and things like that, we'd love to answer them. Um, you guys can also watch those videos after they air live, so make sure you check that out even if you're not on there today. Um, yeah. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to our YouTube channel if you dig the Rat Sesh vibe. Mm -hmm. We'll see you guys next week. There you guys.